Hey everyone, from the top 10 funniest videos last week, coming in 10th place was when you're in a saw trap, but it's 2023. Today you will find out exactly how much you value your life. If you look above you on the ceiling, you will see three vents that will release water in exactly one hour. To get out of this trap, you must find the key in the back of your head. By and does it gotta be an hour? Yeah, what? What are you talking about? Like, can, can you, like, speed it up? Or, are you okay? This is creator Felonious Falafel. What's up? What's wrong? Oh, look, man, I dig what you're doing here, bro. It's 2.45. I gotta be at work at 5 o'clock in the morning, and today's inventory day. And honestly, you're just doing what I've been thinking about doing. So, if we can just, like, ramp up the clock, I mean... Damn, brother, do you need to, like, vent a little bit? Like, <sighs> look, man, life's hard, brother. <laughs> Life is hard. I go to a job that pays too little. I live in a house. I, you know how much my rent is? $1,500 for three bedroom. You're shitting me. Coming in ninth place was how cops treat white people versus black people. Are you the one that called the police? Yes, I am. All right, explain to me what happened. So over there, there's a couple of hooligans around the corner breaking into cars and with the car, you know, let you know. All right, explain to me what these hooligans look like. Dreads? Dreads. I figured, all right, we'll handle it from here. Okay. Got a couple of dreadhead demons on the loose, send back up immediately. Get the safety, sir. Get the safety. Thank you. Thank you. Get on the ground now, boy. Wait, wait, huh? Don't turn around. Keep your hands where I can see him. Get on the ground. Well, what's going on? What's the going on? You fit the description of a robbery suspect. Hands behind your back. I called the police. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'm LeBron James. Shut the f up. This is creator Suburb Baby. Hands behind your back. Suspect in custody. She's lying. I swear to God. All right, all right, all right. Calm down. I heard her side of the story already, but I know at times women do lie. So I'm gonna give you a chance to explain your side. You tell me what happened on your side. Go oh, ahead. Yeah. Get out. That's a piece of trash. She's lying, I swear to God. Hands behind your back. Women don't lie. They may exaggerate at times, but lying is something they don't do. Coming in eighth place is don't arouse the patient. Okay, Bill, how's Mr. Brown doing? Uh, he had an episode of hypotension overnight, but now his vitals are stable. Great, how's his mental status? Well, this morning he was easily arousable and he answered questions appropriately, so I think that... What is it? And how, pray tell, did you arouse the patient, Bill? This is creator Dr. Glaucom Flecken. Tactile stimulation? <laughs> What did I say? Is there another way you could say the patient was easily aroused? The patient woke up. That's right. Now, how many patients on our census did you arouse this morning? All of them. Coming in seventh place was that kid in school who just always lied. If anyone knows any good arm wrestling opponents, please send them my way. Everyone I keep doing it with gets their arm snapped. Trust me, Taylor Swift is not a good kisser. And don't ask me how I know that. But actually, it's because I've kissed her ten dozen times. So far, I've hit puberty about three times. Every new go around, my balls get bigger and bigger. You know that song, Who Let the Dogs Out? That was my dad. No, he was the one who let them out. I wrote it. I get twist my balls like 40 times. You're just gonna have to trust me on that one. Yeah, next season they're making a Fortnite skin of my friend Austin. Yes, they are. This is creator Sven Johnson. Well, okay, you probably know him as Post Balloon, but I know him as Austin. I'm allowed to shoot unlimited animals at my dad's house. Oh, would I look at that? I just got recruited to the Navy SEALs. Yeah, I guess they saw me doing 74 pull-ups in the gym class the other day, and they're like, this guy's the only guy you could probably take out of Osama Bin Laden. I didn't even apply, that's strange. Dang it, I keep getting texts from Van Halen? Hmm, weird, they're asking here if I can take over for them. I wonder what that means, but except I actually know what it means, because it's probably because I'm so good at guitar. Yeah, yesterday the teach gym teacher said I'm so good at gym that I'm an active threat to the other students. Coming in sixth place, is people acting like they don't want to hear about Jada and Will. Hey, yo, Jada Pinkett in the news again. Jada, Jada in the news again? Oh yeah. my God, I do not care. I do not care. What she? What was she saying this time, though? She's saying her and Will used to slap box every morning after breakfast. They used to. They used to slap box for breakfast. Yeah, after breakfast. Bro, I do not care. This is being so forced on us. Yeah. This is creator Patrick Cloud. Who post who posted that? Uh, Shade Room. I'm about, I'm about to go into the comments right now and say I do not care. Okay. Keep this narrative away from us. I'm not gonna lie, her, her press going crazy right now. Here go another post. It's another post. Yeah. Bro, this is this is crazy. This is boy, we don't care anymore. You sure? You kind of look like. What was what was they saying this time? 
Coming in fifth place is What All Men Can't Resist. Hello there. You have found the Lady of the Forest. I've been watching over humanity for thousands of years, and I think I'm finally ready to give back. I'll give you something very special if you give me something very important to you in return. I will give you the cure for cancer. This is creator Cracker Milk. If you give up talking about bouldering on the weekends. Yes. <laughs> Would you like it now? How's your weekend? Mm. Good. I went bouldering. Oh, nice. Nice. How's your mum's um, chemo? Yeah, she's not doing well. Mm. Coming in fourth place is You Broke the News. Tina Titter. And I'm Flint Dicker. And, and this, this is, is news, news to me. Tonight, the world's oldest living woman finally passes away. Oh, how tragic. Well, if it didn't happen now, when? And later tonight, why is the hospital so dang packed? Rumors of a mysterious outbreak have been simmering. And I don't know about you, Flint. This is creator Brandon Rogers. But the only outbreak I'm worried about this year is right here on my face. <laughs> <laughs> Shit's about to get wet and windy as fuck. It's not time for the weather, Nancy. What the weather don't wait, you googly eye piece of shit. This just in, Nancy's a bitch. Excuse me, sir. Do you have a badge? Sir, your badge? I swear to God, one day I'm gonna have your job, dicker. Why don't you put down that knife? That's why people use the weather app. Coming in third place is They're Always Watching. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so a young lady tweeted this picture and said, if you are about to watch a prono, just remember these angels will be watching you. And it's a bunch of angels. It's a legion and legion of angels standing there watching over Earth. Okay, so I got a few questions, just a few. Um, this is creator, comedian Shuler King. All these angels are white men. Hey, no issue with that. I was just wondering where the sisters was at. Talking about, they go, they stand, they watching over me. Good. And I expect you to do the same damn thing that y'all did the, the end time I got in a fist fight. Just stand your ass right there. Did none of them swoop down and help me. Coming in second place is how rappers be lying in their lyrics. If you put faith in a girl, my boy, use a real con. Before I trust a girl, I see a happy mode, you do a frown. All these girls are the same. I swear I'll never settle down. Hey, you got five missed calls from your wife. Oh, shit, let me see. Hello, baby. Now, you just in the studio. Yeah, yeah, you can drive my car. I trust you. Okay, I'm gonna call you later, all right? All right, bye. Love you. This is creator Suburb Baby. Appreciate it. Mm -hmm. Don't talk to the cops, them is the ops. Police pull you over, do not stop. If I see a cop in my vicinity, I guarantee you he gonna get dropped. Fra, fra. Put a switch on the back of that glizzy. Oh, hey, Dad, how's your shift? It was good, it was good. You know, I had the rest of the blue, but other than that, it was good. Okay, well, I'm gonna be down in a minute. Let me just finish the song. Okay. All right, back to blue. Yes, sir. <laughs> and coming in first place last week was Since When Is Ma'am Offensive? Listen, if you don't have a five o'clock shadow or a visible wiener, you shouldn't be offended if I call you ma'am, ladies, okay? Like, I'm from the South, that's just how we talk. I'm trying to be polite, right? Don't make it weird, just let me respect you, bitch, okay? The song's R-E-S-P-E-C-T, not R-E-S-P, let me see them titties, right? That's not what I'm trying to do. I'm not calling you old, I ain't flirting with you. I'm just trying to be motherfucking nice, okay? I went up to Wisconsin this past weekend, should have took a fucking translator. This is creator Dustin Sims. Okay, nobody up there knew what the fuck I was trying to say. Everywhere I went, I would open my mouth and people would look at me like I just left Tom Sawyer on the fucking raft. Like, well, how'd you get here, Huck? It's crazy. This one guy at the gas pump was like, wow, you talk funny. Where are you from? I was like, Alabama. He was like, oh, I'm so sorry. I was like, wow, I didn't say Afghanistan, motherfucker. He said, like, are you from Greenbow? Did you run here for us? I'm like, oh, that's funny, you know, but at least I don't say my vowels in cursive. He's like, oh, what are you talking about? Hope you enjoyed that, everyone. Links to the creator's full videos are located below.